I, I create because um, it's actually the only thing that I enjoy doing. Um, and the only thing I know how to do. <laughs> I know how to paint. When I'm in here talking to people, and I'm talking to my clients, I know exactly how to tell people why I create. But just off the cuff, it's a difficult. It's just, it's just the only thing I, I create it because I know how to do it. <laughs> when I became an artist, I never intended. I was going to school to San Diego State University, and they had a like an internship there. They had a museum, and I did an internship every single semester. And I thought I was going to be a curator or run a big museum one day. And I did it for four years. And for fun, I took a painting class. And I had a teacher tell me, no, that's not the direction. You become a painter. You, this is your thing. Even though my father is a painter and I watched him paint my whole life, it wasn't, that wasn't that. It was that one teacher that told me I was good. And that's what started me. After that, I took a watercolor class. And I had a, a painting on my table, a typical thing that a watercolor teacher would make you paint, like carnations in an ugly Japanese vase with that was this little on a big canvas. I hated it so much. I was at home with a razor blade on my desk, and I started like destroying it, like scraping it as hard as I could, saying I hate this. And I've literally been doing that ever since. So when you see my work, and it looks work and old and scraped is because I'm still doing that with razor blades 30 years later. So it's my main tool is a razor blade. Because I work so hard, like if you look at all my work, I work so hard at making each piece different. I hate the thought of creating something over and over. I don't want a formula and then go, oh, well, that sells. I'm going to make 10 more or 50 more. I'm going to make every painting so different, different color combination, different texture. Um, so you have to solve the painting each time. To start a painting, it's the simplest spill on the floor, um, a few lines. I'll have a painting here, there, there, four desks at home. I can't do that here when I'm at the show. I don't start a lot of paintings here. I finish them here. Just the simple mess, and I can see the design, and it just starts happening. I can wipe my brush there. I can just about anything can start it. I love everything about the celebration of art. <laughs> um, it, it's, it's a family. I've grown up here. I mean, I started the show when I was like 33 or something, like 34, and 22 years. <laughs> Raised my kids in this show, supported my kids in this show, sent them to college to this show. Um, the people that come in here, um, your clients, I mean, this beautiful necklace was given to me from a client that's been coming in here and buying my work for almost 20 years. Every year she buys a piece. Um, the people, the family that created it and run it are the best people in the world. Um, it's like home. So that's what I love about the celebration.